I am Alexi Perulakis. I'm uh, from Greece. My, my parents are from Greece. I grew up in Belgium and uh, I study uh, in Holland. Okay, so uh, what surprised me in Poland is the amount of police uh, there is and uh, the amount of controls. Uh, I have some experiences with my girlfriend, like uh, we, we, we can't drink when uh, like we drive or uh, we don't go on a red light and uh, whenever we did something wrong, like the police has caught us, when you're supposed to go right and do a round and, uh, and not supposed to go left, then uh, the, the police caught us and we had a big fine. So we had some nice experience with the police here. Uh, there's a big contrast with Greece because Greece is much more relaxed on the rules. And uh, okay, I have an extreme example there because I'm from Crete and the uh, police is a bit corrupt there. And I had a friend who was uh, actually very drunk and uh, he was going home and uh, the police caught him for an alcohol test and of course he was very drunk. And, uh, and then they asked him to show his license and he didn't have any. So uh, what they did is just tell him, okay, leave the car here and go home by foot. And that's all he got. And okay, that, uh, that pushes people that they're, not, they're still going to break the rules later. As they're, if you would do that here in Poland, I'm sure there would be more consequences with it. Although the distances between Poland and Greece are quite far, I think the mentalities are quite similar. Greek people are quite disorganized, lazy, and nothing gets done. And apparently I heard that it's kind of the same here. Uh, also, like in gestures, it's very similar. When you greet someone, you don't go and kiss them immediately like uh, you do in Belgium. And, uh, but the difference is that in the gestures, like when you say yes, you do like this. And no, it's like this. Stuff I dislike about Poland is uh, uh, the public transport. When I was coming back from Wrocław to Warsaw, and it took uh, so long, there were stops everywhere, and uh, uh, the condition of the train were actually very bad. And uh, yeah, they really squeeze you. There's not a lot of space, and. Uh, it was an awful trip. I also don't like the weather. It's uh, very cold. For example, when I came here in January, it was completely freezing. But uh, now spring is coming and it's all gonna get better. I like that Poland is relatively cheap compared to Belgium where I grew up. So there's much more things to do and you can go out all the time. And uh, I also like that Poland is a big country. There's uh, seasides, there's mountains, and uh, so there's a lot of places to visit and different landscape to see. I also love uh, Poland's nightlife. There's a lot of clubs and you don't pay entrance for most of them, so you go clubbing and uh, you don't stay in only one club. Uh, I also like shopping malls and there are a lot of them in Warsaw and uh, there's always a place to hang out. Uh, yeah, I really like Polish cuisine. I like uh, the Zurek and uh, I like the Bigos and uh, I like the Pierogi. My girlfriend's mom is always cooking for us all this traditional Polish cuisine and uh, I have to say I really love it. It's a big contrast with uh, Greek cuisine but uh, it's very different and uh, I like it. By the way, Griba Poretsku, the Greek fish, I never heard about it and doesn't exist in Greece. Okay, I have one and believe my taste, it's very good. Uh, Polish women are very beautiful and really know how to take care of themselves and uh, I love walking down the street and seeing all those beautiful women. A funny stuff was uh, when I went to a um, movie marathon. It was uh, for, for Woody Allen movies with some friends and with my girlfriend. And it finished around 2 a.m. So uh, it was in Ursinuf and I uh, live in Saska Kempa. So it was, we wanted to go by night bus because we didn't want to take a taxi from there. 
So uh, anyway, like we took like there was no direct night bus, so we started taking some different night bus, different trams, and it was a mess. So finally, at 5 a.m., we were about like 200 meters from our place, and uh, but my girlfriend couldn't walk anymore, and we we ended up taking a taxi anyways. <laughs> Polish language is very difficult, like uh, it's imp really impossible to pronounce and uh, it's nothing like the other languages I know. I know like Germanic language like French, uh, English, I know Dutch and I know Greek, but uh, uh, Poland is a really different language, like it's a lot of ch, ch, uh, very hard to pronounce and to read, but uh, I'm really interested by it and I'm doing my best to learn it. Yeah, I knew uh, quite a lot. I knew Martin Gortat. I knew uh, Christoph Vazeka, which plays in, played in Panathinaikos for a number of years and was my idol growing up. Uh, I knew uh, Adam Mawish, which uh, I know is uh, really an icon here. Uh, I knew, of course, uh, Jan Pavla Tva. Uh, and uh, I knew Kopernik. Pozdravtam internautów virtualnej Polski. Que yes, que ευχαριστώ που είδατε αυτό το show virtual Naples.